Jeff, aka Curry Ninety Nine, and this is Secret of Mana Remake. Well, we, well, we last left off. We actually we actually got into the Water Palace. We saw Sage Luca, and we also got the spear. We also met, met up with a mysterious girl. But we still don't know the name. We are also advised to head to... The Kingdom of Pandora. Which is actually where we're going to be heading right now. those treasure boxes because sometimes they have poison needles in them. One moment everyone. Okay. We're good. Just had to adjust the sound. No The Kingdom of Pandora. I was told to let you pass when you arrived. Sir Gemma's whereabouts? He has come from Tasmica to meet with our king. I believe he's in the castle now. Oh, just a warning. I wouldn't try to talk to the people in town if I were. I shall take that advice. I know why they're acting so strange, but I'm not going to reveal why yet. Let's check over here. and most of the soldiers are acting like lifeless dolls and no one knows why. I don't want to throw away my life. I've had enough of this dangerous country. I'm moving back home. I was supposed to be assigned to Dilux troop, but I'm no fool. I faked a cold so they wouldn't send me with them. Don't tell anyone. Dilux and his men haven't returned from the witch's castle yet. That sounds suspicious to me. I have to figure out what's going on. Hmm. This is Pandora Castle. Indeed. Why are there people near the entrance to the southern ruins wearing strange masks? That's a good question. Hopefully we'll be able to find the answer to that. When's Dilek coming back? He promised he'd play with me. Did you know there's an enormous tree called a mana tree? That's what they tell me. The souls of the townspeople have been sucked up by that witch up north. This is the end. Our kingdom has been cursed by the witch. 
I don't entirely think so. I think some other something evil lives in the ruins in the south. Some other evil power is at work here. Have you heard? Sir Elman planned an arranged marriage for his daughter. They should be upstairs now. Uh uh. My dad is infuriating. I am in charge of my life, not him. Oh, right. You're that dummy I saved earlier. Sorry about before. Huh. Is that a sword? I didn't know you were a swordsman. What, this? No, I'm actually... This is perfect. Now's your chance to pay me back for saving you. I need your help. We need to teach that witch a lesson. We're going to save Dyla. But I have to go to the underground palace. Save that for later. Come on, let's go. Um, whatever your name is. What's your name? Oh, you can call me. Prim. Nah. That is her actual name, but we're actually going to change it. It's one of my personal favorite. Name one of my personal favorite characters. No, not that. There we go. Sure, let's go with that. Uh, and we also, not only do we get a new party member, we also get a new weapon as well. The gauntlet. Or the spike knuckles, I I call it that. Okay. Good thing I actually bought the hair ribbon, so we can equip that for her. Let's see. Come through suit. Suppose you've seen the state of the townspeople, yes? The witch Elena appears to be draining people's life energy for some unknown purpose. Once their energy is spent, the people seem to congregate near the ruins in the southern part of town. I'm heading there now to assist the situation. You should go to Gaia's navel as fast as possible. Indeed. Where is Gaia's navel? It is north. Not enter. I have no intention of doing so. At least not yet. Is this the right way? 
I should get the path to guys need to think this way. actually a sleep attack. You gotta be careful later on, because once you fight later on, it can poison you. I think this is where the guy is naval. Whoa. Oh, nice. No way. Get out of here. So, first off, though, I'm gonna stop in Kepo Village for a minute. First thing I want to do is save. One night is 10 GP. Stay the night. One night is 10 GP. Do a second save just in case. All right. Let's see. I'm shocked. Stop First by off. Dad's store later, okay? What'll it be? Ah, here we go. This is stuff I was looking for. Mm. I'm gonna buy one chain vest and uh, one medical one. For now. Anything don't else? Have, don't wanna don't have Come again. stuff I have. Okay. Ooh, 
Not bad. Gives our magic defense boost as well. Not bad at all. one thing I should I should mention that the next boss fight can be very annoying not so much hard it's very annoying whoa See how much gold these guys actually get. Okay. Eight. Eh, not, not too bad, but it'll be better. Okay. Eh, that's not bad. There's Neko. Meow. What a strange place to bump into each other. Brrr. Do you need anything? Special deal for busy travelers. I'll even save the game from you. All right. Quick save. Meow. What a strange place to bump into each other. Brrr. Do you need anything? Special deal for busy travelers. I'll even save the game from you. All right. Okay, here we go. Get out of here. This way. Hey, this isn't the way to the witch's castle. Where are you going? Oh. 
Oh, Christ. You can go by yourself. I'm not going in there. So what are you gonna do? Ugh, you're stubborn. Fine, I'll find Dialog on my own. See you around. Hey. <sighs> At least I want to get stubborn. Ow! Million bats. Honestly, God, I think I'd rather fight the bees rather than the bats. These are the guys you want to watch out for, though. The goblins. Them and the swines. These guys. There we go. Nice. Huh, got, got a decent amount of gold there. And yes, your hit points are fully healed. is actually most useful in the next boss fight. Take that! Later! Actually, see what that skull actually did. That's actually a switch. Ah! 
Definitely want to watch out for those goblins. Get out of here. These guys can poison you as well. Fortunately, they're not as bad as they fight later on. They're the real annoying ones. Oh, I think there's a weapon worm inside that treasure box. Okay, let's get rid of these goblins first. That actually lets you escape from dungeons. Very, very helpful item. Ha! Later! This, I believe, is the dwarf village. Ha! Ah, there we go. Ha! Yep. This is Dwarf Village. I thought so. 
Ah, oh my. From the surface, you know a young sprite child got washed down here a while ago. Now they work as a sideshow act. I can hear rumbling from somewhere even deeper underground than we are. Sounds like someone digging. Wait, we've been getting lots of small quakes. See? There's another one. Give me a break. Okay. Let's see how much gold I have. Not bad, not bad. Welcome. What'll it be? Hmm. I think the only thing I'm gonna get right now is the... I think I'm just gonna get the... Headgear. Anything else? Come again. Not right now. I'm actually going to buy the other stuff later. First thing. I'm going to do a heal. One night is 15. Actually, no. I'm going to save. I'll find out why. Shortly. One night is 15 GP. Stay the night? Not right now. actually a blacksmith. Say, hand me your sword. Ah, oh, it's covered in rust. It'll break in no time if you leave it like this. I am Watts, the blacksmith. I'll reforge that for 100 GP. All right. Now wait one second. that it got rusted over. Just looking at it takes my breath away. I hope someday I can forge such a splendid sword myself. What? What's this? My hammer is glowing. Wait, don't tell me that's the mana sword of legend. This is phenomenal. I think the mana sword has imbued my hammer with some of its power. I'll try it out and forge a new axe for you. Come back in a little while. I'm not done with that axe yet, if that's what you're here for. Come back later. Alright. And we actually have a new sword. This is the rapier. And we're not this is actually known as a fencing sword. We're actually not going to use a sword, though, in this in the boss fight. Next thing I'm actually going to do is I'm actually going to buy the spiky suit. Anything else? Come again. And for now, that's all we're going to get. At least for the time being. We're actually not going to sell the chain vest. Because we're actually going to be getting a new character. Anything else? And we're actually going to... Anything else? Good to chain vest to that character. That we can sell. Um, I think that's it. Yeah. That's it. Anything else? Come again.
All right. Now. This way. Right up! That's it! This is Dwarf Village's world-famous sideshow exhibit. Entry is 50 GP. Let's start the show! Our first oddity is the one and only Rabbit Man. <laughs> it's both a man <laughs> And a rabbite. Rabbite man! What? A hoax? <laughs> oh, can't put anything past you, huh? Oh, that's funny. <laughs> and now, I present to you a bona fide sprite child. This kid is the real deal. Oh, woe is me and this sad life I live. Please, kind travelers, won't you help? Come closer and listen to their story. You'll cry. You'll weep. You might even shed a few tears. A lot of people don't know if that's Sprite Child. It's actually a male or a female. I can officially tell you it is a male. This poor child has a 50,000 GP debt to pay off before they can go free. They're working here to pay it back little by little. If you have any heart at all, please help. Even a small contribution of a hundred GP would be appreciated. Ha <laughs> ha! I'll take that! Thank you! What? There's nothing more to see here. Lee! <laughs> That's actually pretty funny. And you'll find out why right now. Ha! How'd you like the acting back there? That guy was on the verge of tears, I can tell. Don't forget my storytelling. I got them hook, line, and sinker. Oh, we'll make a fortune off this scam. <laughs> oh, that's funny. How long have you been standing there? Please, forgive us. This child really is a young sprite. That wasn't a lie. That is actually true. They lived in Sprite Village, but they were washed down into the caves with the floodwaters. So I was just helping them to earn money, to, to get home. Besides, this scam was their idea in the first place. Pretty good con, huh? Hey, apologize. <sighs> Fine. I shouldn't have. Happy now? I am ashamed to have taken part of this ruse. Here's your money back. I apologize. I didn't mean anything by it. I apologize. I didn't mean... Get ready, everyone. The boss fight coming up. Whoa! What? Whoa! Something's coming! Here we go. You'll see the reason why I used the spear on this boss fight. This is why. Everyone, say hello to the Tropicolo. One moment. Keep it 
Spear orb. Ooh. You actually get weapons every time you fight Thank a boss. Thank you very much. Well, I should say. I could have handled those guys orb, myself, you know. Hush. <laughs> Sorry about that. The shock from getting washed away affected this child's memories. They can't remember anything. They're a good child. Just with a few attitude problems and a loud mouth. Yeah, well, it'll all work out eventually. Why rush it? Tropicalo was sealed away in the palace. Since it got out, that must mean there's a way in. If you harness the power of the mana seed, you might even get your memories back, little one. What? Why didn't you say so earlier? I'll go there right now! Mm -mm. You can't go alone! The palace was buried long ago! Who knows how many monsters are infesting that place now? You! You managed to defeat Trepicalo! Would you be so kind as to accompany this sprite to the palace? Indeed. You! You managed to defeat Trepicalo! Would you be so kind as to accompany this sprite to the palace? Yes. What luck! Did you hear that? Now, be sure to listen to everything he says, and don't give him any lip. Actually, has a weapon as well. It's actually the boomerang. Anyway, good luck! You can go straight to the palace using that hole over there. But be careful! That witch from the north, LNA, sealed the palace off with a cave of magma. 
first you have to go to Elena's castle to ask her to dissolve her seal. You know, she wasn't always like this. Elena used to be a good witch. Go north to her castle in Haunted Forest and ask her to open the seal. Here is the set of bow and arrows we found when the little one washed up. Take them. Ah, the shaman's bow. That reminds me. Watts the blacksmith was looking for you. You should stop by his workshop. All right. Well, I tried making that axe, but it didn't turn out how I thought it would. I wonder why. Hmm? What's happened to that boomerang? Wait! <gasps> Try holding this axe! Aha! I can reforge these weapons, but the mana power won't activate unless you hold them. This axe is mighty special. It may be compact, but you can smash a boulder with it. Wanna buy it? Take it with you for 100 GP. Oh, yes. There are more mana weapons out there. Bring them here, and I can reforge them using any orbs you find. Let me show you my special shortcut so you can come here directly. Ready for reforging. That would be the spear. There we go. Heavy spear. Nice. Okay. Now, we're going to put Matsu with. <laughs> First, we're going to give him the rabbi cap. Ooh, that's a nice evasion boost. Like that. Let's see. Do I have anything else you can use? I do. Chain vest. Okay. Well, everyone, I'm actually going to cut the video off. One Just night is 15 GP. Let me save. One night is 15 GP. Okay, everyone. And that's it for, that's it for now. Until next time, this is... Say the Terror of Death, aka Korea on Town 99, and this has been Secret of Mana the Remake. Until next time, Sayonara.